So the Lord is going to bless us all. I'm, getting, I'm ending up here. This is your time. Yo. 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 It started, it will never stop. This is not fashion. It's forever beautiful. It's forever from faith leading to faith. From strength leading to strength. This will remain. God will give you more. He will give you more understanding. So we can welcome the man of God. Remember he was here. Is it three months ago? Remember when we took the tree and I said, he said, I want it. I said, I prayed for him. And he began to begin to begin church. Can you stand up? And then, it's not only him. You saw even others after. But God will show himself. Great Jesus Christ. You know, as the man of God is teaching us, it is of utmost importance that we must take his teaching and mix it with our own faith. Then we practice it. It will be very much unfair for the man of God to sacrifice his time to teach us and yet we remain the same and don't practice what he's teaching us. Because I've noticed one thing at Raboni TV. Pastor Lissiko kept on saying, bring the petrol. And no one brings the petrol. And I said, my God, since the book of Hebrews chapter 11 verse 6 says, without faith we cannot please you. I then said, my God, I'm going to take my petrol. Maybe some of you, you don't believe that this is fuel. I will ask my wonderful sister. You know, Mustan, fuel is flammable. I never wanted anything that is actually uh, flammable. Maybe like paper or wood. Or... I just wanted to believe. So, this is fuel. I will close this one because fuel, when it comes in contact with flames, it burns. Let me put it away. Do you know why? I brought a message to them that we're thinking that this fuel is juice. If you can look at that fuel, it looks like apple juice. But it's not. I want to prove to you with the flame that will burn here that it is evident enough for you to have faith that in the book of Luke 137 nothing is possible with God. Here I light it. Amen. If it is full, it will burn quickly. Hallelujah. I trust now what you are seeing. You are believing. You are believing. What you mean. So 
I'm turning it into a pineapple juice. I'm turning it into pineapple juice. The word is upon it. How is it? <coughs> There's a lot of fumes. Yeah. Uh-huh. But I don't have any uh, side effect. You feel fine? Yes. Had you, you not fine? Fine? So yes. Pineapple juice. Liberty. Tokoloko. Liberty. Tokoloko. Liberty. Amen. You feel okay. I feel okay. You feel nice. Very nice. You feel nice. Keep Very nice. Man man of God. You are a man of faith. Amen. You are a man of faith. Amen. Amen. You are a man of faith. Amen. Amen. Is it possible? Is it possible? Is it possible? Is it possible? With God. All things are possible. Yeah. The word remains. Amen. Heaven and earth will pass. Yes. But my word shall remain. Yes. My word shall do what? Amen. Oh. You want to drink pineapple juice? <laughs> okay. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Is it nice? How does it taste like? It's sweet. Is it sweet? Mm. Is it nice? How is it? How is it? Is it nice? Is it nice? Huh? Is it nice? Oh, men of God, you want to taste? Is it nice? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, all right, all right. Is it nice? Wait, 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 wait. Ah, it's finished. It's finished. It's finished. It's finished. It's finished. Oh, it's finished. All right, it's finished. It's finished. It's finished. It's over. It's over. It's been, you wanted the container. It's finished. Is it nice? I'm an artist. Yeah? Okay, um, only those only those who drink it come. Only those who drink it. Only those who drink. Only those who drink it. How does it taste like? Papa, mm. How does it taste like? How is it? How is it? Yo. It's nice. Yo. The blood. Huh? The blood. It's like the blood. How? You still want you want to even eat the bottle. This one. Is it nice? Very. Oh, I'm not the pump. You want another one? Is it possible that you can drink petrol and become alive? Huh? Is it possible? Speaking of prophetic word, you can prophesy, but the word may end up somewhere. But if it's by the word, it's not the spirit of prophecy. It penetrates anything and turns it into normal juice. Huh? Huh? Did you enjoy? You're a man of God. How are you feeling? It's like pine, as you have said it, pineapple. It tastes like pineapple juice. It was pineapple juice. Pineapple, as you have said it, it tasted like pineapple juice. Pineapple juice. Pure. 
sure 100%. Listen. Reta. The word does what? Remains. And if the word remains, nothing can change the word. If it's darkness, God says, let there be light. God cannot lie. It will become light. Did you enjoy? Was it nice? I'm going to give you next time. Don't worry. Don't worry. You enjoy it? Huh? Okay, wake up. Wake up, you. Wake up, stand up. Is it nice? You want some more? I know. You... Okay, okay. Do we believe people? Do you believe? I mean, I mean, he's one who was driven by faith. Because when I say bring it, it will happen. It will be pineapple juice. It will be what? It will be what? It will be what? Did, did you enjoy it? I enjoyed it. Key fruit tree. How did how did it taste? You want some more? You see, it's nice. Huh? Do you love Jesus Christ? Look, these are times. If Moses was there, he did strange miracles. Jesus came. If nothing happened after Jesus, something must happen. Something must happen. So, for he said, you will even do greater things. If the cloud is lifted up, it's because you are criticizing, you are doing bad things. But you must remain. You must do what? We must do what? Do we love our father? Do we love our father? Huh? Huh? Can you imagine you can't have a baby and you come, you drink petrol. All of a sudden, tomorrow they say, no more barrenness, you are pregnant because of drinking. How did it taste? Ah, it was just normal to me. It's just that the flames were uh, there in me. Felt the flame? Yes. But now, are you normal? I'm normal. I'm normal. Huh? I'm very so you he felt the, the taste of the flames. You felt the taste of the flames. Yes. And, and and now when it comes in the stomach, ah, it's just normal inside. Ah. Jesus. 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 Do you want some more? <laughs> Next time. Are we blessed, people? Are we blessed? This is not a circus. There are no magicians. This is reality. It's a reality. reality. Did anybody die since we spoke now? Uh, can you drink petrol? Can you? <laughs> You. Look, when the oh, word no. is spoken upon anything, it changes. It changes. It changes. Look at people. So who are dressed. Are dressed. You still want some more. You are the first one to taste. Is it nice? Very nice. You want some more? I love you, Jesus. So, camera people, you can interview everybody. But I I don't go. I want to drink it. You ran away, you. You ran away. Huh? And some people are saying, we're going to see today. Even my general is scared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, my general. My general is scared. Even if 
you are scared, but when I command you to come, and you come, you come, come, you come whether you like it or not. Whether you like it or not, you will come. This command is not an ordinary command. Come. To find yourself here. Those who were here yesterday, this morning, you saw. You saw the demonstrations. Right? Now you understood. Right? Whether you like it or not, you come and you do as the word says. And it tastes nice. I can feel it in, in, my, my, leg. leg. in my legs now. And I'm going to run faster than anybody. <laughs> Unleaded petrol. Not super. super. But the latest petrol. Turning into pineapple juice. Huh? But <laughs> it's scary, ne? Huh? It's so scary, ne? Eh? This is prophetic. When you speak about prophetic, it's not just speaking into a person's life. And the word ends up there. This one goes deeper. Turning things which are dangerous to be friendly to you. Huh? Huh? Sure. Some of you are still scared, sure. ne? Right? And some of you want to drink, eh? Oh, shame. Right, I'm going to minister to everybody because of... You know? Huh? Are huh? we blessed? And it's so nice. I can feel it. Like yeah. To me, it's like the thing is still... It's just changed. It's like I have carrying something fire inside of me. I believe men are going to be blessed. It's like it has become an anointing. Hey. Do we love our father? 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 Can we do that? Who's going to prove this after this? I know they're going to post on Facebook. By tomorrow, it will spread. By tomorrow, it will be everywhere. Hey, by tomorrow, they will be talking. He started again. I mean, everything is tested. The grass, the trees, different types, petrol, anything. What manner of man is this? What manner of man is this? But I'm serious, God is going to bless you mightily. Remember when I say, I feel when God is opening another page in my stomach. I feel the same. I feel it now. Because when he gives you the book to eat, when another revelation is given, it comes out with a stripe. It's painful. So I get the same thing now as I speak. Do we love our father? Do we love our father? Listen, I say anything. I say anything. It's just people you are afraid today because it's petrol. But remember one thing, how you were afraid when it's only grass. When you went to the tree, you were so afraid. You took the most the, 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 the dangerous tree outside. You became more afraid. You took petrol. You become more afraid. You will no longer be afraid. You will no longer be afraid. You will no longer be afraid. Greetings, saints. Welcome to Rabboni Center Ministries, the first one of God. 
where the miracles, signs and wonders are happening here at Rabboni Center Ministries. And uh, last week, we had a phenomenal experience that happened here at our church, where a true man of God came forward, taking a leap of faith, he bought petrol. Now he took all scriptures into consideration in terms of uh, the flaming fire. He explained and went through with us as to why he took that leap of faith by taking petrol and coming with it to, here to Rabboni Center Ministries. Now that, that he explained was that when the man of God kept making the demonstrations of power, he kept saying that you must bring, bring petrol and then I will turn it into pineapple juice. You will drink it and you will not feel anything toxic. Now he took that leap of faith. He brought the petrol and it was prayed for by the man of God, Pastor Leseho. He drank it and he is still alive as we are, as we as you can see him next to me right now. And also what he did is that he demonstrated that it is truly fuel by pouring it into a bowl and lighting it. And it truly went on fire. And that was to show us that that thing was toxic. It was petrol. And then again, the man of God, after praying for it, called his sheep. And his sheep came forward. They drank it. They also confirmed that what they drank was pineapple juice. Now he's here with us to share in the light of what happened after that. He's here to share with us the great wonders of God in his life. Hi, sir. How are you? I'm blessed and favored by the grace. We are also blessed. Can you introduce yourself again to the viewers, telling them what is your name and surname and where do you come from? I'm Pastor Morati Desmond. I'm from Jaira Kingdom of God Ministry. I'm originally from Venda. So, Pastor, let take us through the experience of that drinking the petrol now let's talk about petrol on its own being a not a consumable thing this is a toxic substance yes. and it has effect on a human body exactly. but you drank it yes. the following week can you tell us did you have any side effects of drinking a toxic non so um, something that is not supposed to be uh, drank like petrol did you have any side effects of that maybe before I could answer that question I would like to let other people know this. Don't do it at home. And don't drink fuel without being in the level of the Spirit. When the Holy Spirit didn't say to you, drink it, uh, you will die. It's a very poisonous substance. It is actually regarded to have high metals on it. That means that it is undigestible within the blood. Once you drink it, you will die instantly. Therefore, it is only the power of the living God that will turn poisonous substance so that it could become um, edible. So to me, after I drank, I had no side effect the following week. I was actually on top of the world because on that day, I was on fire, you know. I don't know whether you understand how does the human body burn when you've eaten too much of acid. The whole body was fire like that. And I, I said to myself, thank you, God, because you are now turning my blood into fire. You are mixing it with the blood of Jesus. Because I believed in me that surely my faith will take me to the higher level. So, Pastor, we have had grass eating. We have had um, the men of God calling sheep to sleep. We had had them slapping them and they did not feel any pain. We had him climbing on top of them and they still didn't feel any pain, no fractures, nothing. And then we have had this one. This is just um, power on another level. We have had you consuming a toxic substance that can kill you instantly. Yes. Now, the body of Christ has experienced um, so much criticism on every level, on every angle, from media to con other congregants. How can you encourage fellow pastors, fellow congregants, people who are watching in the way of the Lord, in terms of this that had happened with consuming a toxic thing and still being alive as we speak? What I can give an advice to the pastors and the rest of uh, the Christians out there, my fellow brothers and sisters, what is happening here, it is the word of God. It is the manifestation of the prophetic word that is being spoken long time before you and I were born. So if God says, let it be, there is no one who has the power to say it is within his jurisdiction to stop it. Mm. Uh, when God opens the door, mm. there is no man who will close. Mm. Instead, God grows what he has started. Because in the book of Numbers, God said, I'll speak the word that shall come to you. And whatever I speak, it shall be. And 
I'm not a man born of man. I'm self-existent. So if you are a man of God and you are stopping what God has started, that which is a promise that is also including you, that means that you are limiting yourself. Amen. There you have it. Blessed you is a wonderful testimony indeed. He says in his word, call unto me and I will do I will show you how to do much more greater things than the one that you have that you have not seen before. Now trust in him and believe in him, because he is the God of the impossibles. He opens doors that men cannot shut, and he also shuts those that men cannot open. To God be the glory.